Welcome back to Dober Cars, everyone. I'm here with my brother Lucas, and we are here at Ferrari of Philadelphia. We're seeing a badass car right now. This is the Ferrari SF90 Spider. This is a $1 million car right here. If you guys ever want to get a Ferrari, come to Ferrari of Philadelphia. Yo, start it up. I want to hear it. You guys ready? Yeah. All right, one more thing. You guys have been asking a lot about the STO, whether I'm going to get a new car, whether I'm going to get it fixed and get it back. Right now, I don't have it, but I think we're in a good location to seek some new adventures, and um, I think this is the perfect way to start, so let's start yeah, it up. You might get a new car, I might get a new car, maybe Marcus today, we'll see. Alright, you guys ready? Yeah. Give this video it. a thumbs up, let's get it. something really Italian. This might be as Italian as it gets. We got a 1955 Ferrari Europa GT. This is so limited, super rare. Where's, where's Marcus doing in there? He's bro? already inside the car. Yo, it looks crazy in here, look. Yo. Yo, this car is actually a V12 too. Naturally aspirated V12 engine from Ferrari. And look at the classic design, the dashboard, the wheel, everything. 1955, still looking fly. That's crazy, so are you thinking about going Ferrari or still Lambo? I'm not gonna lie, like, one of the first supercars I've ever specced out in my life when I was in high school was the Ferrari 458 Italia. Black with a tan interior, black wheels, yellow calipers, but I don't know, man, like, definitely something Italian, you know? Yeah. So, we'll see. Guys, this is literally not just a car, it's a work of art. You can see the little designs, the lights on the side, the wheels. You know, the tail lights. I mean, this thing is, it's an Italian stallion, V12. Crazy fact as well, to put gas in the car, it's not on the sides of the car, it's actually in the trunk. Oh, is it? Yeah, the Italians, they didn't want to mess up any of the body of the car, they want it to be smooth, so. And one more fun fact, that SF90 Spider was about $1 million. This right here, $2 million. So, place your bets, place your bets. <laughs> yeah, why don't you get the F8? Bro, this thing is sexy, man. Ferrari F8 Trabito. Hey, it's clean. It's got the tan. I call that the peanut butter interior right there. Yeah, it's fly. Clean. I don't know, Luke Smarts, what are you guys thinking? You have a Ferrari supercar already. Maybe something different that no one really else has. Yeah, honestly, we're definitely going to walk away today with a new car or a spec one. But what do you think, bro? I mean, I'm trying to look at the La Ferrari downstairs. Yeah, let's go look at the La Ferrari, and then we might be specking out the Ferrari SUV that just came out. So no, we are specking it. Yeah. Hey. Yeah, I kind of like the Ferrari Roma. That's sick. Yeah, it's pretty nice. Yo, Lucas, your twin brother right here. Yeah, my pista. Not actually my pista, but yeah. <laughs> All right, guys, the La Ferrari Aperta. These are the La Ferrari's spider. So the roof comes off. Yeah, this is by far the best Ferrari they ever made. Yeah. Sexy. If you guys haven't seen already, we have raced a lot Ferrari in a previous video, so make sure you guys check that out. Check out our videos, like, subscribe, turn on those post notifications. Alright guys, so we're about to spec out the new Ferrari SUV, the Ferrari for a song way. So, let's see what color we want. Gosh, you guys gotta go crazy on this. The interior, you gotta put carbon fiber in there everywhere you can. I don't, I don't know, it depends on how crazy you wanna go. But what do you guys think will be the craziest color? Dude, I mean, Ferrari. Might have to go red like you guys have been doing, but I want to say I'm so proud of you guys. Like, you guys are copying a Ferrari truck, bro. That's so fire. I think no matter how you spec it out, it's going to end up looking super sick, and that thing's going to be a beast. What, V12? Naturally aspirated? That's crazy. Yeah, that's crazy. Wait, so what color red is your pista right now? That is Rosa Corsa. Okay. Yeah. I'm going to go sit on the Ferrari seat, bro. It's comfy over it there. Comfy. <laughs> so, wait, your A12 was what color? It was Rosa Scooter, Scooter yeah. Okay. But I think we might have to go with the Corsa for this one, right? What is the Corsa? They both look good, but it looks just a little classier. Thanks, dude. You know? I got this you. Is, this, is a... this is the Corsa, right? Yeah, that's it. Yeah. Yeah. Right, so this one's, this one's kind of dark, a little more mean. This Let's see what it looks like with a flashlight on. Oh, that's fire. Yeah, that's yeah. yeah. your traditional red. Yeah, Gotta match the, the piece, though. Do you guys feel like you're replacing your A12 with this? Like, kind of, or no? Do they sound the same, or like, what's the difference? I mean, they're both V12s. I can't wait. I don't know. Like, we'll see how Damn. it sounds. I've never heard. That's crazy. SUV with a V12. Yeah. yeah. Similar? Like, yeah. Very much like the Lusso, like the A12. Also, if think. you listen, I haven't heard the car, but if you listen to the videos online, it howls just like, it sounds just like a Lusso and an A12. Wow. wow. 
the screen. Yeah, it's yeah. definitely loud. It's still camouflaged, but it's being thrashed around Fiorano, and you can clearly hear the wow. 12 cylinder. Wow. The CP with the V12, that's, yeah, that's the first. Crazy. There's nothing in the same that's close. Yeah. Nothing. How much horsepower does it have? 725? Yeah. 725 horsepower. And and the Urus Performante has how much? 660. That's gonna be a good race Whoa. though. Hey, make sure you guys like and subscribe. We're definitely gonna have to line those up and you know maybe up against the cyber truck. We'll see. Now do you like the porcelain shields or do you like the airbrush shields? You can do the airbrush logo, which is considerably bigger. Conserve weight, bro. It'll be faster. <laughs> Conserve weight. Uh, that's just the regular shield. That's your traditional porcelain shield with the indentation on the fender. You can do this, which is bigger, that's, that's and not it's like airbrushed. Right, I don't want it, the airbrush. One. So the car would weigh how much? Around 4,400 pounds, 4,700 40, 40, 40, pounds? Yeah. Okay, that's crazy. So, I mean, Dar said it's safe weight. It's only going to be like, what, one I milligram? Mean, yeah. <laughs> you I'm don't kidding, obviously. The <laughs> There's no right or wrong. It's just personal preference. What is the piece to have right now? It has the... Original yeah, no, we have to get that one. You want to do the yeah. shield? Yeah. Yeah. shield. Yeah, it's fire. It's just official. The front like almost reminds me of the SF90 a little yeah. bit, you know? Like that new style headlights, cool. Now, for your wheels, that's the standard wheel. I'm going to go through each one okay. just to show you your options. So that's the Matt Regio wheel, which is the standard wheel. Now, this is when you start getting into the forged wheels. That's the diamond forged. And this is called Orbit Gray. And that's pretty much good. These two wheels, I think, are really going to be like the trademark wheels of the car. Depending on what color calipers you guys get, like... I say I say yeah. match the piece, though, bro. Like, you have the supercar version, now you have the super SUV. Yeah, that's like Need for Speed Underground when you're customizing yeah, your car. You like the style. Yeah. Real life. Those are fresh. Those are clean. What do you like as far as brake calipers? I heard everyone kind of throwing around different things. Can I see in yellow? Sure. Dang. Dang. And then also in black. Let's switch to Damn. And black is fresh too. Oh, Pretty it's... tough. Oh, yellow, yellow, yellow. You know it's a Ferrari for sure. I mean, either way, you know it's a Ferrari. But well, didn't you do the uh, Urus and red? Yeah. So black, maybe black looks yellow. crazy though. Yeah, red's cool too. Yeah, yeah. It's hard. Yeah, it's hard. <laughs> and then I'll switch it to. But then yellow, it's like that's gonna pop for sure. I I say yellow. So yellow. I'm gonna say yellow, yellow or black. I say, uh, I'm sure. voting yellow. So I'll we'll keep it yellow for now. It just looks yeah. faster with yellow, you know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> I think that's the I think that'll be like the yeah. last thing, so it'll be yellow after that. Everything else will be flush from there on. The yellow makes it look more sporty. For sure. Yeah, it looks yeah. faster, like I said. Like when you see any car with the different colored calipers, like it's like the wheels are the shoes. The calipers are the socks, yeah. you know? It's like subtle, but like... It makes a difference. Yeah. You know, you're wearing some Italian socks, you know what yeah. I mean? Yeah. What do you like for an exhaust pipe? Standard is, you know, a shinier aluminum. They do a matte burnished aluminum, so it's going to be like a... I don't want to say titanium, but it's going to be a matte color. Not as dark as titanium. And then you have the matte black. <laughs> yeah, that's the bomb. Stirred. Yo. <laughs> Stealth bomber. Yeah, mm -hmm. it's matte black. Yeah. Wait, can we see it straight from the back? Dang, Ooh. that's clean. If Ooh. this is anything like the Luso was, the Luso was a $20,000 option for the panoramic roof. But on the resale market, a Luso with a panoramic roof sold much better than one without. Yeah, that sunlight is always gonna beam on you. There aren't many options that I'll say that, you know, I really tell you like you really, really need it. On this, the panoramic roof, I think is going to be a very high take rate. I think it's gonna be something you're gonna want in the car. I'm just kind of putting it together for you now, because we can always take away, right? Yeah. How about, um, are you gentlemen big fans of the carbon fiber on the outside? No, really not. Okay, so we'll leave that alone for you. It's fresh. This thing is fire. So we're about to check out the interior now. We have Koyo here, uh, traditional Ferrari, tannish interior. What if you did, uh, you should look at that one and also try black with red trim maybe, yeah, yeah. you know? Do you think like too much red is like too much red or nah? I don't know. Like, but the red is great. It's like you're entering in a different world, you know what I mean? What's the differences between the seats, like sports seats and stuff? Oh, just gives you the addition to add more red. Yeah. It's not often to then to where you sit. So leather, no. It's classic. I'm not gonna lie. It's 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 we don't have to select any. Oh. Bellissimo. I have a question. Are we able to make this 
into leather or does that stay? I'm gonna look and see. Okay. Yep. On the side right there, on the door handle, is that silver or what color is that? Can that be black maybe? That's silver. Let's look and see if we can make that carbon. Black. We can make it black, yeah. That'd be good. Carbon fiber wheel with the LEDs. The leather wheel. That does LEDs. match the center console. You so. want the carbon fiber? I love carbon mm -hmm. fiber too. Yeah. I always yeah. love that. Yeah. We probably don't forget that. I think the steering wheel is probably the only thing that really matters to get carved in. It's like your chariot, like, you know, you, you gotta hold on and that's where you control, you know, like, the entire car, so that's hey, what I'm saying. Lucas, yeah. on your pista, are the paddles carbon fiber? Yeah, they are. What do you think about the carbon fiber paddles on this? I think they just you come with that. that, with the steering wheel. Oh, it's standard. You had that. Yeah. No, no, we switched it when we did the steering yeah, wheel. Yeah, it comes oh, over, so good oh, call. Fresh. Good fresh. Yeah, piano black is also classy, like. Yeah. You're gonna be looking at the steering wheel more than the center console, you know what I mean? So, can't go wrong with carbon fiber, <laughs> yeah, like, you know? So, fresh, it's up to you yeah. guys. Like, yeah, it's just too fresh. You, you know how much Lambo is SUV, Ferrari SUV, no. McLaren, they gotta come so out with SUV right. too, yeah, so we can all race our SUVs. Yeah. We'll see what happens though. So. Come on, Elon, come out with the Cybertruck yeah. quad motor, let's go. <laughs> Wait. Uh, you said we could put a stripe on the hood? Yeah. yeah I just wanna see how it looks, just just cause I'm curious, you know? What color, It'll make it look what color stripe stuff. would you like on the outside of it? What color? Nero? What else? Black. I just don't like anything with a stripe on it. It's not a special edition. Can we do a yeah, carbon fiber true. hood? That is true. <laughs> Can you do a carbon fiber hood or not? It's <laughs> crazy. <laughs> Yeah, but it's, uh, it's yeah I don't like it. it just yeah. on the roof now, it just looks like it's cut in half. Yeah, yeah. It looks like tape. That's crazy. Oh, that one. <laughs> <laughs> that's awesome. Uh, that's crazy. Yeah. We're, We're not gonna do that. You're not gonna do that. No. <laughs> Bit, man. Bro, I think that's it, man. That's definitely an L and M Ferrari right there. You like the red on red? I like the red on red. Yellow. The black on face. yellow. Is that the roof is panel? Uh, I don't think they decided on the panel. No. Nah. But uh, hey, they can still change their mind whenever they want. That looks clean, cause like you know they might want to keep it low key and stay in the in the dark, you know. So, yeah, for sure. I think it's sexy, bro. Lucas, Marcus, I'm proud of you guys. You guys deserve that, bro. Drive that thing safe. Hey, let's go.